Good morning all. Today we will solve another numerical question on half transformation. So in this question we will use this equation rho equals to x cos theta plus y sin theta in order to determine the equation of line for this given set of points that is 0, 0,5, 1, 4, 3, 2, 3, 3 and 5, 0. So let us solve this question. So in our previous lecture, in our previous lecture of Hopf transformation, we have used this equation c equals to minus mx1 plus y1 in order to determine the equation of line for a given set of points. But this equation has a major limitation. If the lines are vertical if the slope is very very large then we can't use this equation in order to determine the equation of line for the given set of points so to overcome this problem so to mitigate this problem we will use the equation rho equals to x cos theta plus y sin theta in order to determine the equation of line for the given set of points so how to solve Numerical question based on this equation, let us solve a numerical question on it. So we will use this equation rho equals to x cos theta plus y sin theta in order to determine the equation of line and the given set of points are 0, 0,5, 1, 4, 3, 2, 3, 3 and 5, 0. So, so for each of these points we will determine the equation of rho. So in 0, 0,5 this is my x coordinate this is my y coordinate in this equation rho equals to x cos theta plus y sin theta in place of x I will substitute 0 in place of y I will substitute 5. So the equation becomes 0 cos theta plus 5 sin theta that is this equation is reduces to 5 sin theta similarly for 1 comma 4 the x coordinate is 1 y coordinate is 4 so in this equation in place of x i will substitute 1 in place of y i will substitute 4 so the equation of rho becomes cos theta plus 4 sin theta similarly for this given point 3 comma 2 in place of x i will substitute in place of x i will substitute 3 in place of y i will substitute 2 so the equation of rho becomes 3 cos theta plus 2 sin theta Similarly for 3 comma 3 in this equation in place of x I will substitute 3 in place of y I will substitute 3. So the equation becomes rho equals to 3 cos theta plus 3 sin theta. Finally for the given point 5 comma 0 in place of x I will substitute 5 in place of y I will substitute 0. So the equation of rho it becomes rho equals to 5 cos theta. So this is my step 1. For this given points we have determined the equation of rho. Next we have to draw a table. So in this table this side we will write the value of theta. So in this given question, range of theta it is not given to us. So we will use the standard values of theta. Those are 0 degree, 30 degree, 45 degree, 60 degree and 
90 degree. Now this side we will write the equation of rho. For the given point 0, 0,5 we have determined the equation of rho it is equals to 5 sin theta. For the given point 1,4 we have determined the equation of rho it is cos theta plus 4 sin theta. Similarly for the given point 3,2 we have determined the equation of rho it is 3 cos theta plus 2 sin theta. For the given point 3,3 3, we have determined the equation of rho it is 3 cos theta plus 3 sin theta. And finally for the given point 5,0 we have determined the equation rho equals to 5 cos theta. Next for each of these theta that is 0 degree, 30 degree, 45 degree, 60 degree and 90 degree we will determine the values of rho for all of these equations. So let us solve let us determine the values of rho for each of these theta value one by one first for zero degree for zero degree we know sine zero it is equals to zero whereas cos zero it is equals to one sine zero degree equals to zero whereas cos zero degree it is equals to one so in this equation in place of theta, if I substitute 0, 5 sin 0, it is 0. In place of theta in this equation, if I substitute 0 degree, cos 0 is 1, whereas sin 0, it is 0. So it becomes 1. Similarly, in this equation, it becomes 3 cos 0 plus 2 sin 0, which is equals to 3. In this equation, if I substitute theta equals to 0, it becomes 3 cos 0 degree plus 3 sin 0 degree it becomes 3 and finally in this equation in place of theta if I substitute 0 5 cos 0 degree it becomes 5. Next for 30 degree for 30 degree we know sin 30 degree it is equals to half it is equals to 0 0.5 whereas cos 30 degree it is equals to root 3 by 2 that is equals to 0 0.866. So now we will substitute in place of theta if I substitute 30 degree this becomes 5 sin 30 degree sin 30 it is equals to 0 0.5 if you simplify this up to one decimal place it is equals to 2.5. Similarly, in this equation, cos theta plus 4 sin theta, if I substitute theta equals to 30 degree, it is cos 30 degree that is equals to 0 0.866 plus 4 sin 30 degree that is 4 into 0 0.5. If we simplify this, it is 2.866 and up to one decimal place it becomes equals to 2.9. Similarly in this equation in place of theta I will substitute 30 degree 3 cos 30 degree that is 3 into 0 0.866 plus 2 sin 30 degree that is 2 into 0 0.5. So if you simplify this it becomes equals to 3.598 and up to one decimal place it becomes equals to 3.6. Similarly for this 3 cos 30 degree that is 3 into 0 0.866 plus 3 sin 30 degree that is 3 into 0 
if you simplify this it becomes 4.098 and up to one decimal place it is 4.1 similarly for this 5 cos theta it is equals to 5 cos 30 degree that is 5 into 0 0.866 which on simplification it becomes 4.33 and up to one decimal place it becomes 4.3 similarly we will repeat our calculation for 45 degree we know sin 45 degree it is equals to cos 45 degree it is equals to 0 0.707 that is equals to 1 by root 2 so now in place of in place of theta we will substitute 45 degree so first 5 sin 45 degree it is 5 into 0 0.707 it is equals to 3.535 and up to one decimal place it is equals to 3.5 similarly for this if we simplify cos 45 degree 0 0.707 plus 4 sin 45 degree 4 into 0 0.707 that is equals to 3.535 and up to one decimal place it is approximated to 3.5 next 3 cos theta plus 2 sin theta if we substitute theta equals to 45 it becomes 3 cos 45 3 into 0 0.707 plus 2 into sin 45 2 into 0 0.707 it becomes equals to 3.535 and up to one decimal place if you approximate it it is 3.5 next 3 cos theta plus 3 sin theta in place of theta we will substitute 45 3 cos 45 3 into 0.707 plus 3 sin 45 it is 3 into 0.707 on simplification it is equals to 4.242 and up to one decimal place it is approximated to 4.2 next 5 cos theta so in place of theta we will substitute 45 so it is 5 cos 45 that is 5 into 0 0.707 and it is equals to 3.535 and up to one decimal place it is approximated to 3.5 next for 60 degree for 60 degree we know sine 60 degree it is equals to root 3 by 2 that is equals to 0 0.866 whereas cos 60 degree it is equals to 1 by 2 that is equals to 0 0.5 so now in this equation we will substitute theta equals to 60 degree so first equation 5 sine 60 degree that is 5 into 0 0.866 it is equal to 4.33 and up to one decimal place it becomes equals to 4.3 next for this cos 60 plus 4 sin 60 cos 60 0 0.5 plus 4 sin 60 0 0.866 on calculation it is equals to 3.964 and up to one decimal place it, it is approximated to 4.0 next 3 cos 
60 degree plus 2 sin 60 degree it is 3 into 0 0.5 plus 2 into 0 0.866 it is equal to 3.232 and up to one decimal place it is, it is approximated to 3.2 Next, in this equation, if I substitute theta equals to 60 degree, 3 cos 60 degree plus 3 sin 60 degree, it is equal to 4.098 and up to one decimal place, if I approximate it, it is equals to 4.1. Finally, in 5 cos theta, if I substitute theta equal to 60, it is 5 cos 60, that is 0 0.5, it is equal to 2.5, and if I approximate it to 1 decimal place, it remains same, it is 2.5. Finally, we will determine the values of rho for theta equals to 90, and we know sin 90 degree it is equal to 1 whereas cos 90 degree it is equal to 0. So for 5 sin theta it is equals to if I substitute theta equals to 90 it, it is equals to 5. In this equation if I substitute theta equals to 90 it becomes 4. It is reduces to 2 it is equal to 2. The value of rho for this equation it is 3 and the value of rho for this equation it is 0. Now after determining all the values, now we will check the voting. For 0 degree, 0 got 1 vote, 1 got 1 vote, 3 got 2 vote and 5 got 1 vote. For 30 degree, 2.5, 2.9, 3.6, 4.1, 4.3 all got 1 vote. For 45 degree, 3.5 got 4 vote and 4.2 got 1 vote. Similarly, for 60 degree, 4.3, 4.0, 3.2, 4.1 and 2.5 all got 1 vote. And for 90 degree, 5, 4, 2, 3, 0 all got 1 vote. So now if I compare all the votings the value of rho equals to 3.5 it got 4 vote and the corresponding value of theta it is 45 degree so the so the maximum vote it is obtained by the rho equals to 3.5 and the corresponding value of theta it was 45 degree so now in this Standard equation rho equals to x cos theta plus y sin theta. In place of rho, I will substitute 3.5. In place of theta, I will substitute 45 degree. So in place of rho, if I substitute 3.5 and in place of theta, if I substitute 45 degree, so it becomes x cos 45 degree plus y sin 45 degree. So, the, so for the given points, so for these given points using this equation rho equals to x cos theta plus y sin theta, we have performed the half transformation and we have obtained the equation of line. So with this, this question is over. Thank you all.